What's up, everybody? Guess who's back? Guess who's motherfucking back? Africa G is motherfucking back after a whole ass vacation. All hail to all mothers because being a dog mom is so fucking stressful. I know being a regular mom, like not a regular mom, like an actual mom for a child is way worse. So I just want to say shout out to y'all. I'm going to give everybody a round of applause. You know what? Give yourself a round of applause because having dogs really just taught me that um i am not ready for kids i'm only 22 years old if you guys didn't know africa g is only 22 okay and i'm about to turn 23 my birthday's in a month less than a month and i'm so damn excited i did something crazy if you guys haven't noticed if you guys haven't like guessed it i did something super crazy yesterday but i'm not gonna um share my little secret until the end of the video I'm going to start off by doing a haul. I walked into the store and I saw some things I liked. So I'm going to show you guys a haul of what I bought at the Outlets of Orange, or as I call them, the block. Got all this and all this. So let's start off with the shoes. The first pair of shoes that I saw were these. These are fucking cool. I love them. So these are the first shoes that I got me. Because how dope are these? They look so comfortable. I don't know if they are. Hello? Stop calling my phone. Hello? Just kidding. But Anyways, these are so cute. I love these. I can see myself wearing these. They don't really match my hair. But it's okay because soon I'm going to go black. With my hair. I might. I'm going to do more colors before I just go black. But I think my hair has had enough of it um no i really like colored hair but then i just feel like sometimes like it's really hard to match your clothes sometimes like i can't wear like red because then it looks ridiculous and i got these shoes these are so cute like they have like this little metal thing in the back so bomb right i love these they are so cute i feel like these do match um i feel like these do match me um but these are so cute. Like, I love them. Oh, and then look at this. Like, this is bomb. Like, when I'm, like, doing a push-up or, like, you know those exercises that go, like, I, you can't see. Just see in the mirror. Like, those. I, you know what I'm talking about, right? Like, those exercises that you go like that. Like, you're pushing and stuff. Well, these shoes are for that day, honey. Because I ain't pay for some nice ass like, this. If nobody's going to see them. Like, what the fuck? got the same juice juice <laughs> got the same juice i got the same shoes janet got oh i know why i said juice because shoes and janet i was gonna say it like you know i got the same shoes janet got these are so cute like they look so comfy like i'm so excited not exciting to see at the bottom but it's okay like these are so cute i like these a lot so i got these shoes i didn't even know i had four pairs of shoes which ones are these oh i know which ones these are these are purple i almost forgot i was like what other shoes did i get but i actually do remember i kind of wanted to get a color of each um because i haven't bought shoes in a while like nike shoes i used to buy them all the time because like this i work out a lot i run through my shoes a lot like they get super dirty super black i try to clean them but it's never the same you guys know after cleaning them it's just like never the same i got these shoes these are fucking dope i love these shoes i should have worn these for yesterday's i mean not yesterday's uh last week's outfit because these are so cute i, I love these shoes oh and i like how it has i don't know what this means but it says I don't know it's just like a bunch of writing i don't even know what the fuck it says but like it looks pretty cool traction 1.35 grf whatever the fuck that is if you know what that is comment down below let me know because i don't these are cool these are like bomb as hell imagine they were neon like at night like that's cool anyways these are the other shoes that i got so cute i got me a gym bag because you know like we have a lot of things that we use like here girl problems Ay. okay you guys get the point nike bag it was on sale for like 40% I'm like I have to get it 
And then it was like $24. And then 30% or 40%. So I was like, hell yeah. Sign me up. So, um. Michelle. I don't know. Oh. Sorry, babe. Okay. So, like I was saying, I have these really cute like leggings that could go really cute with anything really. Like they could go with these. I really like these with these. They could go with these. Sorry. They could go with these. These. Like this is so cute. Like, even if I bought my main girl shirt, like, I don't think I'd be, like, Regina George. I think, really, who I'd be is, like, um, what's that girl? Katie? I think her name was Katie. I think I'd be, like, Katie. If you're from Africa, why are you white? You guys know how many times I heard that growing up because of that movie? So then I got these sweatpants. You guys know I love sweatpants. I live in sweatpants. I have sweatpants right now and i got some more sweatpants because a girl loves sweatpants more than anything in life more than dresses more than anything i love me some sweatpants then i got me this cute little sweater you know pink with the pink hair mm -hmm. can nobody tell me Okay, but yeah, no, this is really cute. I really like this sweater. It's really warm. It's really cute. I love pinks. Um, can you tell? I love pink. Can you tell? I love pink. Can you tell? Can you tell? Can you tell? I love pink, and you could definitely tell. So, I got this sweater which i love because it's kind of like those incognito kind of sweaters that kind of just hide your whole face well sometimes i need to hide my whole face because i'll be going somewhere and someone will be like hey and i'll be like oh shit i look bad i look horrible no i'm just kidding i'm never like that. i'm actually really nice if you guys ever see me in person and if you've ever seen me in person and you're watching this you know i'm really nice really welcoming i got another black sweater just like that says Nike, it's really black, simple. Sometimes, like, you just need a black, plain sweater. It's these. It says just do it on the side. I think these with, like, these shoes would be so cute. Like, oh, my God. Come through, gym outfit. And I don't know what's going on, but Nike right now at the Outlets of Orange is popping, y'all. Y'all need to stop watching this video right when it's done. So not right now. And get your asses to the outlets of orange because we got some fire shit. Oh, I got these um sweatpants. They're so cute. They're just, you know, I love sweatpants. So I saw these and I'm like, I gotta get them. They gotta be mine. These are probably my favorite from all the ones I tried on. Like these are so cute. Janet also wore these already. In one of the videos that you guys saw. These are fire. They look so nice. They feel great. Um, they look great. Um, they even have like a little zipper in the back. You know, come through little pocket. Yes. I don't know what the fuck I fit in there. Then I got this little shirt. I never really wear shirts like this for the gym and stuff. But I thought it was cute. Like a cute little match. Like, you know. I got this bra. Janet also wore this one already, but she wore it under her sweater, so you guys probably didn't see it. She loved it. It has great support. This one, it's like I don't have anything tan, so I thought, why not? Like, I, I don't usually buy tan, but I thought, like, this is cute with my hair. It's also cute, you know. It's, you know, something different. Me, I always gotta go for the same shit. Same man, same everything. No, sis, get you a whole new one. Just kidding, y'all. Unless, you know, you know you deserve better. It's a new year. It's time to leave him now. Okay? Okay. Then I got this to be... <coughs> oh, thank you. Thank you, like, somebody... Ain't nobody here. I'm over here saying thank you, like, I really said bless you. I mean, if you did through the screen, comment bless you if you really did. <laughs> Cause that's sweet. That's 
So like I was saying, and then I got the small, I tried on the small this time and it was so tight, you guys. Like it fit perfect. It gave me great support. I loved it and all, but like it was too tight. Like to take it off, to take the small off, I struggled so hard and I'm so tiny still. So I, got, I just bought mediums. I just like switched them out because the line was crazy to like try them on again. So I'm like, all right, I'm just going to risk it and just buy medium. So then I got this one as well. It's so cute. I love it. It says, just do it. A lot of you guys asked me where I got my white one from. The white one I got though somewhere else. I don't remember where I got the white one. But I do remember getting this one at the Nike store. Alright y'all. Well, thank you for doing this haul with me. Next time I kind of want to try them on. Make it a little more fun, you know. Before I go. I have a big secret to tell you guys, so I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready. I don't know if I want to share with y'all. I don't know if this is the right time. Just kidding, y'all. Just totally kidding. But basically, what I have to tell you guys is that oh, I see Michelle. Actually, I'll wait for the second video. The next video. Ah, just kidding. Who knows when that's gonna be? So let me, let me just tell y'all now what's going on. So. You guys know, um, I really, really, really been wanting to get my lips done, so I got them done. Yeah, you guys didn't notice. I got my lips done. Now you can notice. Now you're like, oh, girl, I see it. <laughs> I did get my lips done. I went to Sev Laser in West Hollywood. I only got half a syringe and I went to go get a full syringe and the girl saw me and she was like, look, babe, I'm going to be very honest with you. You already have very big lips, very full lips. If I do the full syringe on you, you, cause I told her I want it to be natural. I want people to question, did she or did she not get her lips done? I don't want it to be like, oh, that bitch got her lips done. Who knows how many times she's gotten her lips done. If you guys want to know the truth, just once. This is my first time. And I'm not going to say I'm never going to get it again, but that shit hurts so bad. Like, I was in legit tears, gushing tears. Not like, <sighs> but no, not like that. But like, I was like, oh, shit. And there was like tears running down my face. I think it was because I was on my period. And she did say that when you're on your period, um, your pain receptors are more active. They're more prone. They're more like aware and they kind of let you know. So if there's a needle injecting Juvederm or whatever, like whatever they inject, um, your pain is, your pain is going to be like a lot more unbearable. And for me, it was so painful. I was like, why the fuck? Like while they're doing it, I'm like, why the fuck am I here? Why did I, my crazy eyes want to get my lips done? I should have never gotten my lips done. And I only did half a syringe, but I'm also not fake and I'm very open with the fuck I do with my life because like, I really don't care about people's judgments. Like I really don't care to make other people happy. I care to make myself happy and lead by example. If I show you guys that it doesn't matter what the world says, do what makes you happy, then go and do what makes you happy. I can't exercise my lips and shit, so I got them done. This is like the swollen look and I guess it's gonna go down but i really love them i am very happy with them i feel like they were on too much and honestly it was worth it once i left there i was like okay this wasn't that bad i'm just exaggerating but it did hurt bad oh i thought you know i'm turning 23 i'm not that young anymore if i want to do something i should go ahead and do it something i wanted to do for a while i was on and off on and off about it that's my little secret now. You guys are not allowed to tell anybody until they see this damn video. And then I'll let the world know. But that's my deep, deep secret. But you guys, like I said, only you guys know. You guys are the first ones to know. I did not announce it. My social media. So, shh. And comment below if you guys already know. I want to know if that was like a shocker. What you guys think. And let me just tell y'all, if y'all have any negative comments, like, don't even bother because honestly, all I do is just block, it takes a second, block negativity out of my life in real life and comments in any kind of life. I don't even deal with it. I used to be like, bitch, what's up? What's up? Like, square up, pull up. Like, what's up? And now, you know, I'm not that bitch anymore. 
what's the point of fighting like i used to fight a lot and what did i win from it nothing besides miss nails a few bald spots you know because bitches love full of hair so like what's the point of fighting? i don't i don't get the point anymore like i don't i don't think it's fun i don't think it's cute um just don't find the point anymore yeah these are my lips No, but seriously, I just want to say thank you guys all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love y'all. Thank y'all for holding me down. Thank y'all for showing so much love and support. Um, and yeah. Bye-bye.